Hi everyone, welcome to Edu Video World. This is Varun Ganga. In this class, we are going to see one more example regarding multiplication of numbers by Niklam Sutra. The example that I am going to take here is 92 into 93. So 92 into 93. I am going to show you how we can do multiplication with the application of Niklam Sutra that is in case number 1. So here before going to start multiplication for these two numbers we have to find base for these two numbers. The base for these two numbers is 100. Why? Because means the 100 is the only number that is very near to 92 and 93. Now what we have to do after finding the base you just write 92 here and 93 below it and you just place a horizontal bar and also a vertical bar like this. Now you just see the numbers 100 and 92. So 92 is 8 less than the 100. So you are getting less numbers, so you have to write minus 8. Now you just check 193. So 193. 93 is 7 less than the base and you have to write minus 7. Why? Because it is less. After writing these digits, that is minus 8 and minus 7, you just multiply 8 and 7. So minus 8 and minus 7, what you will get here is 56. We just write down that 56 in the below of the first column here. So writing 56, now what you have to do? You just do cross subtraction. Either of the ways. If you do 92 minus 7, you will get 85. Or if you want to do in another way, that is 93 minus 8, you will get the same answer 85. You just write that 85 here. But remember one thing, here in the base you just got two zeros and the product of this right column that is the first column you have got two digits. So in 100 you are having two zeros and the product of this column has also got two digits. So when you get like this there is no problem. If you get more than two digits as the product if you get the product more than two digits, then the base is 100, that is, when the base is having only two zeros, then there is a small problem. We will discuss about that problem in another example. But here, you have got no problem. So, there is no need to worry about it. So, now you just see here, the answer, what you got here in the next column is 85. When you do cross subtraction, you got here 85. You can club these two numbers 85 and 56. So therefore the answer that you will get when you multiply 92 and 93 is 8556. But I am going to tell you one more thing. What is that is you just multiply the cross subtraction answer with the base. What you are going to get 85 into 100 you will get 8500. And you just add this 56 to that number. 8500 plus 56, you will get 8556. And so therefore, you have got the answer for multiplication of the numbers 92 and 93 as 8556. Hence, you have understood pretty well, when you get a two digit number, no doubt, these two digit numbers are very near to 200, so therefore I have taken the base as 100. And I have just followed the procedure that is in case number 1. So in case number 1 tells you that when the digits are the numbers that are going to get multiplied are less than the base, you just have to take the less number with minus sign in it and you have to multiply these two numbers you have got 56 and after getting that number you just do cross subtraction 93 minus 8 or else you can do either of the ways 92 minus 7 you get the same answer 85 here you can club both these two and you can write it as an answer 
but why I'm doing this is you just keep it in your mind. In the upcoming example, if you got the right column answer more than the zeros, that is the digits of the answer of the right column are more than the digits that are in the base, that is zeros, then you have to follow this procedure. So you just keep it in your mind and we are going to apply this type of procedure in the upcoming examples. I think you have understood pretty well how to do multiplication of numbers by applying Niklam Sutra. Thank you.